Hey guys, today's on Schizophrenia and Hope. Schizophrenia and Hope, but before we get to Hope, please allow my brief prelude. As you know, I've conveniently recorded it for our mutual comfort, our mutual convenience, and our mutual luxury. And hey, listen, I'm no spring chicken, and I've been around a few preludes in my ears. I'm telling you, this kid, this prelude, it's got something that's particularly luxurious. Kind of like a... Going culinary, eggplant, parm. Very Hello, luxurious there. My name is meal. Robert Francis. You've stumbled on my own. There's a book two here, the YouTube companion. Me and the the old switcheroos and play. That's right, that's right. We talk schizophrenia. Book one. This is the cut of my jib right this here. This is known as the old switcheroo where the companion. I'm a licensed clinical social comes worker to bear. 15 years. That's a lot of gabbing and chatting. I've been diagnosed with schizophrenia on, for a score five and one. And that puts a little gray fleck in my beard. Thank you for joining me on my channel. Companion. Now to topic, to topic, to topic. Where, where there is life, there is hope. People have, uh, suicide, suicidality is driven by a lack of hopefulness. So where there is uh, life, there is hope. Um, hope, is, uh, hope is being amid the dark, schizophrenia included, psychosis included. Being amid the psychological dark be it even maybe the environmental dark or both and having a having a really a, a struggle and a problem um amid dark that casts its dark life will cast dark um life always casts its darkness it's um it's hope is holding on to that light amid the darkness you're going to be in psychological darkness uh, throughout your life. I'm sorry to break the news to you. It happens. It happens. Not all the time. Schizophrenia certainly can induce a darkness. But uh, hope is the, the light amid the dark, the, the lightness amid all the psychological dark. And even if there's not dark or light, excuse me, even if there's not light, there's the anticipation of uh, light in the future. So it's both uh, anticipation and presence. So whatever the darkness is you're going through, please always know that there's a casting of light to, uh, to grab onto to, and then try to cultivate. Schizophrenia will cast its darkness like nobody's business, that's for sure. But when you're in mid the dark, never, never, never forget the light that is available currently or the anticipation of light to come. So that's the essence of hope. And where there's life, there's hope. Uh, eggplant parm. What is that? Eggplant parm is a very luxurious meal. Very luxurious. Love the eggplant parm. I love, love eggplant parm. You know how hard it is to prepare the eggplant? It is no, no easy task, I'm telling you. But once complete, pressed, fried, baked, it's a it's a really good meal. I don't know if you have you ever had eggplant parm. Italiano, Italiano, I got Italiano in me. I do, I do, I do enjoy an eggplant and always maintain your hope and we'll see you next time.